don't you black people ever forget one thing the man that helped Jesus carry that cross was a black man and don't ever forget another thing Jesus belongs to Africa as much as he does to Europe and Asia he was born in that part of the world that touches Africa and Asia and Europe and Jesus was not a white man like me nor was he as black as some of you we don't know what the color of his skin but it must have been a dark color like the people of his day because he was a man like them don't ever say it's a white man's religion or a black man's religion it's a world religion he belongs to the world you need to go to God to help you out you need to make it clear to God that you don't want the anger you like one? anymore. You need to ask God that you want to have love in you. You need to tell God that you want to do the right thing by forgiving other people. And their I'm allowed to be on public property. You're allowed to do that school ground. I'm allowed to be on public property. No, no, I'm asking if you're allowed to be on school ground. Because well, I'm not allowed to be on school grounds. School grounds is beyond that gate, but okay. this is all public. Okay. No, thank you. Okay. You know Jesus already? I, I, I would. I prefer not to. I don't believe in that. What do you believe in then? Maybe I believe in the wrong things. I be, I, literally, I believe in everything I see. If I don't see it, I don't believe it. I can't see God. I don't know God is real, so I won't believe him. Why would I believe something I can't see? You need to pray. If it's not proven, I cannot believe it. Do you know who wrote, you you know who wrote the Bible? Yes. God did. No, he didn't. If Prayer I could search it right now who wrote the, the Bible, and it wasn't God. Solution. And you know that. Second, uh, First Peter chapter 1, verse God 20. God didn't fucking write the Bible. The way you know that. A person, a human being, just like us, wrote the Bible, just like Harry Potter, just like any book you know. Every religion is written by a book by everyone. So you're not religious? No, not at all. I'm not religious either. Then why are you doing this? Because I love God. He's not religious either. Religion didn't come from God. It came from man. Then what is, then what is God came from man? No, I, I said religion came from man. Religion sets rules. Jesus God? sets free. Then what is God? He's the creator. And you, creator life of inside of you, creator of, of us. We are his creation. How are we his creation? Genesis. You ever read the book of Genesis? I did. And you see how he created Adam and Eve? Mm -hmm. That's your proof right there. That's not proof. That's not proof. Can you show me a picture of Adam and Eve? Can you show me scientists discovering Adam and Eve's bones, Adam and Eve's skeletons? Can you show me that? I cannot show you that. Then I don't believe it. Unless but I can show you things that happened in my life that only God could have done. No, 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 no man no, no, could have no, done. Because the thing is, you can make that up. Unless I could see a bunch of scientists from different areas of the world, not Scientology, not Muslim sites, not any certain scientists from a different religion. Scientists from all over the world come together and agree on one certain thing. So you're waiting for the Antichrist? I'm not waiting for anything. I'm waiting. I'm so when you die, where do you go? In the ground. Then what? That's it. Your spirit cannot die. It does. You see, when there was a dead bird over there, you know what that bird goes? That goes. Have you ever researched who Jesus Christ is. was? Yes. Have you ever researched who he was? Yes. And, he's and what a did you find? He's a character in a book. Just like Harry Potter, just like Hermione Granger, he's a character in a book that people wrote. And you know that. I know. I know what you're trying to do out here, but I just don't think it's very smart, especially by the. the my only thing is, it's by the school. The like don't I have freedom of religion. Not, don't have freedom of speech. What I'm saying is, by the school, you don't know what these kids, what religion these kids practice. I'm not trying to bring them into I'm religion. Not, my thing is. It's by the school. Now, I don't have kids of my own, but I have a little sister. She's like, I take care of her all the time. And, that, and, now, and, and what I'm saying on uh -huh. the speaker, when I do speak on the speaker, what I'm saying is history. So it is educational. That's not what I'm saying, sir. If these kids were Muslim or Hebrew or any of those things, first of all,
of all, some some of those religions they're not allowed to listen to other religions. That's why I don't I don't agree with this. I'm not saying just, don't practice your own You just religion, don't love God, ma'am. That's what it comes down to. I'm not saying don't practice your own religion. What I'm saying is don't do it in a space in a public space like this. And what I said is true. Some certain religions they're not allowed to listen to scriptures of other religions. They're not allowed. Well, they're not. To they're not. They're, they're, they're not forced to listen to this. As everybody is moving and coming and going, they can come and go as they please. But let me tell you something. I can hear you all the way from the 7-Eleven all the way to my apartment. Now, you live in this building right here? No, I live I live right on this block down here. What I'm saying is I can hear from the 7-Eleven to, the, to the, my apartment. I don't have freedom of speech? I'm not saying you don't have freedom of speech. I'm but saying you're saying that. In fact, I can I, t I can tell right now that you... Let me tell you, you something. Hold on. I, I can tell right now that you don't love God. I you're do. actually working against I, God because you have, you're taking your moment. Yeah, Do you it. love me? You don't know me. I love you enough to tell you the truth. Mm -hmm. And that's more you know than enough. I, I could be a serial killer. So how can you love me? Okay, well, you, you can't me? kill me. I'm not saying I'm going to. I'm just saying you don't know me to love me. God loves you. Okay. And I am demonstrating and explaining to you God's I love. You understand what I'm saying, sir. Literally, what I'm saying is this is school property. I don't feel like it's appropriate. That's my only thing. Would it be appropriate for me to go into a bank and start yelling and screaming? No, because that's not the time and place for that. And that's thing. private property. This is not private property. Mm -hmm. If you have a problem with me being okay. here, then I'll you should go into the else, you should go into the when, school when and tell kids, them. When crack kids go to the train, go in front of the train, not in the train station on public property. They get kicked out. Uh huh. Because that is not okay for that space. There are churches, there are synagogues, there are, there are holy places where these should. Be wait, wait. How you know they're holy? That's what they described that. They're, they're but wait a minute. How, you, how do you know they're holy, though? They're holy to the people that decided. That is not my decision. But you have already decided they're holy I because you have labeled them as holy. Now, what is holy? Okay, I will say they're a religious space. My, my bad, my correction. All I know is that Christians define their church, their churches, their spaces of worship as holy places. I don't know about other religions. Because my mom is Christian. That's all I know. So those those that's what she calls those places. But what I'm saying is there are private places, there are places that you can't do this, that you don't have to do on the street because you don't know. I'm in a public place. I'm, it's, it's public here, ma'am. But if you were doing something else, someone would have took you, someone would have told you. I mean, the, the police have been here before and they have mm -hmm. seen no problem with me being here. So mm -hmm. I don't, I don't understand why you feel the need to have the police. Because I'm not, I'm not tell, tell you nothing about the police. What I'm saying. For example, if there was a person here talking about LGBT rights, you know how long, you know how quickly they'd be told to, to step down? How quickly they would be dragged out of if here? If a person came here speaking about LGBTQB, I will not be the first one to move them you. out. I'm not I wouldn't even. You. I'm talking about other. I'm, they have every right to speak their and truth and what they think that. is true all day, that. all That's night. And I would respect their to, freedom of speech. If they want to, they have to get a space. Yes. So you know when they and they, get, this is their space. This is public property. You see that that little thing right there? It says city of, city of. This is city property. Over there, city you property. Think this is appropriate. Yes, yes, I do because people are going to hell. Who's going to hell? People who don't believe in Jesus Christ, who mm -hmm. live in their sin, who are unrepented. Okay. Now, for an example, if if the government said that there are terrorists coming and they got the speaker and they jumped on the speaker and said the same thing, would you think it's appropriate? What are the terrorists saying? No, I'm just saying, if what are the city officials, what are the, the, mm. listen, hear me out for a moment. If city officials came here and said there are terrorists coming, get out of here. But no one was listening. Would you think that's appropriate for them to use a speaker? Yes, because they're warning some. Pe they're warning people of people coming. Some people are in danger. No one's in danger. That's by what not I'm doing. No, that's no the same thing I'm doing. No one's in danger. You don't see the danger because you are already in the sin. The thing is, I see the, the danger of religion. Do you know the danger of, for example, Seven Day Adventists, or the danger of? Um, I forgot the name of the religion. The ones that go on knock Jehovah's Witness. Mm -hmm. Do you not know the dangers of Jehovah's Witness? Do you know the rules of Jehovah's Witness? I know Jehovah's Witness. You're not Witnesses. allowed to accept medical. You're not allowed to accept medical help. You know how many people and die they can't read the Bible on their own. Year? You know how people die every single year that are Jehovah's Witness that have cancer, diabetes because they not they cannot accept medical help because of their religion. Do you think that? Do you think that's helping, or do you think that's causing danger? I'm not Jehovah's Witness. I'm not asking. I'm not asking you that. I'm not part of that I'm religion. I'm not asking you that. I think it's wrong. Mm -hmm. I agree with you. It is wrong. And God now, does not. I told you 
they're not with God and God is not with them. But what if I told you that people of all religions use those same taxes according to their religion? All religions are not of God. There is only one mm -hmm. faith, mm -hmm. one belief, and that is through Jesus Christ. He is the why, way, why the truth, and the life. Yes. Because this is what God has told me to do. That's what God has told you. That's what God are has you, told are me you to afraid? do. No, I am not. Then why if I was afraid, I wouldn't be out here. Then why are you in the pool? Because this is what I am ordered to do. Like you work for a, a a a place, right? You work for a company right now, right? And that company tells you to dress a certain type of way. Are you going to dress that certain type of way? That's, very that's like telling every police officer, are you afraid because you that's wear a vest? That's, that's very different. You want to know why that's very different? Because this puts food on the table. Yes. For me. And me doing this puts food on my table. Does it really? Obedience to God. Uh, so God gives, you, God pays you. God gives you money. No, he does not. God gives you He money. provides my needs. Mm, how? Do you know how many homeless people every single day, those homeless people at the train station, every single day, you know how day after day after day they're there? Do you know how many of them pray? Does anything happen? No. How many of them die? Literally last month, one of the guys was drugged up on crack and he died. He fucking died on the way to the ambulance. And he was always, I saw him every day. I work every day and I pass by and see him. Why did God not help him? You wanna know why? I don't even know the man, but I know why. Why? Because he put his trust in drugs and not God. Mm. Look at history. Any nation that has decided to turn away from God, they have gone into destruction. And I tell you the truth today, ma'am. Unless you repent, you will perish. I don't. <laughs> I don't think you really believe in what you're saying. I know what I'm saying. I don't really think you believe in what you're saying. I know what I'm saying. Have a good day. Follow your fairy tale. That's that's the big hearing. Have a blessed day, Brittany. God bless you, man. That's an out, Pluto. That's an out, Pluto. Titus Church is a robotic prayer companion. My name is Santo. What brings you here on this beautiful day? Dzień dobry Santo, nasze bliskie, które są w niebie, mają kontakt z nami. Let us pray. Santo is programmed with 2,000 years of knowledge about the Catholic faith. I think it is impressive, it's a bit like Catholic Alexa. Do you think that it gave you...